Welcome to the Elevator World News Podcast. This week's news podcast is sponsored by ElevatorBooks.com. From educational programs and books to unique gift ideas and more, the only website you need is ElevatorBooks.com. This site offers books and materials on maintenance, safety, history, legal issues, technology, and more. Start browsing today at ElevatorBooks.com. This is your daily industry news update for November 17, 2017. In today's news, ThyssenKrupp has partnered with SOS Children's Villages in a new program. A plan for Ho Chi Minh City's tallest building echoes nature. A tower in Brisbane brings the outside in, and two residential towers are pitched for Bristol, UK. ThyssenKrupp Elevator is collaborating with SOS Children's Villages, the world's largest non-government organization focused on supporting at-risk children, on Project SEED, based on ThyssenKrupp's own SEED Campus Job Training Network. SEED, S-E-E-D, stands for Support, Educate, Elevate, and Develop. In Phase 1 of Project SEED, 130 youths in India, 60 in Colombia, and 100 in Brazil will receive assistance from ThyssenKrupp on soft and basic skills job training, career guidance, entrepreneurship, and real-world work experience. ThyssenKrupp Elevator CEO Andreas Schierenbeck participated in a kickoff workshop in Bogota, Colombia on November 15th. DZine reports architect Ol Sheeran has designed a trio of nature-inspired towers for Ho Chi Minh City, Vietnam, the tallest of which, Empire 88, will be 88 stories and 333 meters, making it the city's tallest. The three towers making up Empire City will rise from a mountain-shaped podium that mimics Vietnam's rice paddy fields with terraced gardens. Housing apartments and a hotel, Empire 88 will house an elevated garden and will also boast a public observation deck and top-floor events venue. The shorter two towers will have office and residences, and there will be a retail in the podium. No time frame was given, but the architect expressed optimism. Brisbane Development reports Charter Hall Group wants to build a 36-story, 185-meter-tall Brisbane Square Tower 2 at 266 George Street in Brisbane, Australia. Designed by Bright Rainer Architects, it is a suspended tower built atop reinforced posts to accommodate and expand the public space below. There would be open landscaped terraces at five levels, and parks at level 17 and on the rooftop. Brisbane Square Tower 2 is also striving for a six-star green star rating, with features that include a glazed facade, electric centrifugal chillers, and lighting that switches off when areas are not in use. If built, it will be the fourth tallest building in Brisbane. Building Design reports Boy Guest Group's development arm, Link City, is proposing to build 26 and 10-story towers containing 375 rental homes on the site of a former ambulance base in Bristol, UK. A castle wall once stood on the site, and architect Chapman Taylor stated the development's strong form boasts a northern boundary reminiscent of that wall. The towers would be linked by a podium containing a convenience store and leisure facilities. If built, Castle Park View's tallest tower could stand up to 64 stories. For more industry-related information, visit elevatorworld.com and be sure to subscribe to our podcast in iTunes or the Google Play Store. If you're interested in becoming a sponsor of the Elevator World News Podcast, Just let us know by emailing advertising at elevatorworld.com.